deficiencies of micronutrients are a major global health problem. More than 2 million people in the world today are estimated to be deficient in key vitamins and minerals. It is for this reason that Choma Fisheries Department, working hand in hand with the National Food and Nutrition Commission, with support from FAO, has facilitated fish farming in communities to ease access to healthy foods. We stopped about uh, uh, a total of, of 22 dams. Choma has got 28 watts, so of those 28 watts, uh, 22 have uh, uh, community dams that have been stocked with 2,000 fish in each dam. And then the other uh, six watts uh, that do not have uh, community dams, that is where the seven fish ponds have been uh, established. Under the same scaling up nutrition program, the Choma Forestry Department is also facilitating beekeeping projects in communities. The other intervention that we are uh, doing is uh, beekeeping, where we have trained uh, a total number of uh, 60 women in beekeeping. These uh, beneficiaries were supported with six beehives in total. So we thought we introduce uh, this aspect of uh, beekeeping production in uh, scaling up nutrition so that our beneficiaries are going to have uh, honey as a main diet for which when they consume honey they are going to uh, benefit from different uh, nutrients that are in the honey. The benefits of these interventions are being realized by the beneficiaries. <laughs> Kuli fish pond awa. E fish pond ya tu kwasha maningi. Tula huwanswi. Hako mena nswi hia. Tula zela. Siyama na guzel wanswi hia. Theni tula sanina ibana. Uh, Inzugi. Tuwa lgo ya kutichintu jita hupi iki imaningi. Kere gui indamu mungoma. Ihaku ihanzugi. Ihi sumpu gide. With support from FAO, centers of excellence have been established to provide the learning platform in various farming activities for beneficiaries of the SAN2 program. Wakunelo Stali, Zanis, Inchoma District, Southern Province.